Jose Manuel Alvarez said Spain is flexible in its efforts to secure a deal for joint prosperity in the area, adding there's already agreement on many aspects. However, he said it's inflexible in its defense of what he termed sovereignty and Spanish interests. The Spanish Foreign Ministry rejected what it called the claims to British sovereignty over Gibraltar's waters and territory. It described the statement by Number 6 and the convent as especially incomprehensible at a time when, it said, Spain has put on the table an agreement to create a zone of shared prosperity. The Spanish government condemned the aggression towards the Servicio de Vigilancia Aduanera officers and called for effective measures in the fight against smuggling, which it said negatively affects the whole area. For its part, the Junta de Andalusia also asked the Gibraltar government for collaboration and conviction in the fight against smuggling. Spokesperson Antonio Sanz told reporters in Spain that the smugglers are the real enemies and lawbreakers. While asking that the fight against smuggling not be confused with diplomatic matters such as sovereignty, he however claimed it was clear that Gibraltar has no jurisdiction over the waters where the incident occurred. The incident was reported in the Sunday Times, which quoted a Foreign Office spokesperson as saying the UK government regrets and condemns the assault suffered by the two officers and wishes them a speedy recovery.